apparently Chris G plays FOB style. He does? Yeah, it looks like it. Hey, I have another brother. FOB style, if you guys don't know, is Melty Blood style, which is A, B, uh, light, light punch is A, medium punch is B, heavy is C, and then light kick is D. It's kind of, I don't know, I started using it just because I was at Taiwan, and all the arcades had every KOF set up like that, so I just had to learn. But uh, the traditional style is just the Neo Geo, where you just go A, B, C, D from uh, light kick and up. But here we go. This is Grand Finals, King of Fighters 13, Civil War 4, Rai Rai versus Chris G. What's the set here? Is it 4 out of 7? No. <laughs> yeah. Like Don't get around. Steve H versus Justin, that was a classic set, man. Four out of classic. seven? I, don't, I saw the YouTubes for that. It was, that that took way too long. It, it was fun, though. Anyway, Christian, of course, in winners right now. Rai Rai trying to come out of losers. Needs to win two sets. What's interesting is Rai Rai is using the same tactic that he used at Winter Brawl. He puts Benny Mar at first. I forgot why he did it, but I think he's just more comfortable fighting King with Benny Mar. Oh, oh, no. Wow. Oh Drop no, that. that's even worse. Oh wow, no punish on that. That's that's really negative. Stops his jumps. Rai Rai rocking that bionic arm Benny Mar. Oh, I think I have a feeling Rai Rai likes to put Benny Mar first just because he wants to catch the other guy jumping. I think he's more comfortable with anti air and with uh Benny Mar than any with any other character. Really? He's getting those fireballs out. Full screen. Yeah, Chris G playing a really nice range game right now. It looks similar to, uh, I don't know if you're here watching Mortal Kombat Finals, where uh, oh, dude, no. we're just throwing out like the Tiger the tiger D fireballs over and over and over again. Huh. It serves the same purpose. I mean, it creates the space that you want, keeps him from really being able to run in or jump in. Chris G looking really solid right now. Yeah, Rai is forcing, forcing Rai, Rai to use those guard cancel rolls just to get him in the corner. Really nice from Rai, Rai. Nice little stagger. Come on. Mm, good draft cancel from Rai, Rai taking out King. But Kyo is kind of hurt. Say about like 30%, 40% life. Yeah, I mean, not a not a whole ton of life left. Uh, and, he but just, and he just used that drive bar. Yeah, he, he used you know one drive bar there. But um, I, I do believe that EX kill can lock down normal kill a lot better than the other way around. Especially if Rai Rai knows that Chris G loves going for the level twos. Yeah. But yeah, Rai Rai. He, he doesn't even need a jump, he just knows. I don't think Rai Rai's jumped once in this entire match so far. Oh, there we go. But that was after a whiff. That's in the corner. Alright, yeah, just like that. Next hit will win for either player. Oh, there it is. Oh. Uh, one bar, Rai Rai. No need to blow two there. Or do a better combo. I mean, no need to blow one, but yeah. I mean... If you're going to do that, there's, there's definitely no need to blow two. But, Kill got all his life back. Well, 50 probably. Well, still 45. 35, 35 my bad. Yeah. 38. 39. Eh, 38, no. 38. 30. Okay, okay. 30. All right, this is good for Rari. He's forcing uh, Chris G to use resources to get Benny to get his go. Out of there. Throw. Oh! Nice. I believe he just recorded it would have just hit him out of there. Maybe a trade though. Final round. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> 
you. I'm not going for any of that shit. Uh oh. It's gonna hurt. Oh, oh no. Don't get thrown again though. Yeah, Chris G jumps out of the corner just because he wants him. Rara right in the corner. Drive cancel. Oh. Low back. Oh, good break. Uh, good break from yeah, Chris Yeah, I think G. Rara's used that setup a couple too many times over the course of this top eight. On, on Chris G, though? Well, then again, Chris G is constantly watching. Yeah, Chris G's watching. Oh! Like, I know he used it on D-Rez a number of times. Yes. Um, you know, it's, 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 it's been seen. And he hasn't switched it up yet. I haven't seen any other option out of there that he's gone for. So. Well, the option is either he'll cross you up or he'll just land. Uh, I don't think that's that good of a mix-up. It's pretty easy to see. Yeah. But he has to, he has to have another another option out, out of there out, aside from the throw to get you to just, you know, to keep you from just taking strong reaction to that. You know how you break those? You just do a super. Yeah, just do it. Yeah, Fuck just it. do a super or do another DP move. Oh, wow. Something rare you see from Rai Rai. Wake up DP. Gotta throw it out there sometimes though. Let them know. Cut. Oh, nice. Rara sees the jump. Responds with a level two. What? What? Man, I think yeah, it, I, don't know what that, I, mean, I think Rara was trying to do that. Yeah, the EX, yeah, the yeah, EX only thing that makes any sense gold. there. But I don't see. I don't know. That's all that makes sense though. And that's actually a really smart play. Uh, to try to use that, but it didn't work out. Yeah, because he knows that Chris G is constantly jumping yeah, back. Throwing, yeah, don't jump the fireballs, yeah. There has to be an answer to that tip. Ooh, jump C. Hits him out of the air. Battle the kills again. Oh, wow! Jump C, down C, and Chris G crosses up, gets a solid combo, no drive cancel. But you get so much meter from doing that combo, though. Yeah. Uh, DP? DP? Oh, okay. Send it early. Oh, there's oh, that wow. roll, yeah. So Rai Rai was, uh, you know, baiting other people. See, there we go right for. there. Rai Rai went for that, uh, the setup off of, like, the empty air jump slash thing. And instead of coming down with a throw like he had, but he just came down with just close C. And he counter hit Chris G. Didn't actually finish up on it, but that's what he needs to do to actually make that, you know, somewhat of a threat. That's what I was talking about earlier. Wow. Really nice. But I hit neutral jump D. A good answer from Chris G, but I guess the hitbox on that is just huge. Yeah. Neutral jump, like neutral jump normals are really good to just stop people from jumping in all day. Yeah, definitely agree with that. Whoa, what? Oh, that's too far. Oh, there we go. Will he finish it? Link. Can't get too close to Benimaru. He might throw you in the corner. Yeah. 
Danger. Oh! Out of guard, can't throw old back out of there. Well, that whiff? Oh no. my god, just a rough play. Kill. All right, Rari has a chance to do something Oh here. my god, do it again. Do it again, yeah, do it again. Watch out for the super. Oh! Rari gets the ESDP! The guy in the Street Fighter snuggie in the crowd just got really hyped. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I'd have, he, Rara had three bars there. I'd have done that shit three times in a row. Nigga, deal with it. The only thing that Benny Mar can do is the EX lightning bolt, but that takes time as well. Yeah. Did he even have the meter for that? Yeah, he had two bars. Okay. All right, Rara, Billy meter, with a command grab. Guess he really wants it for something. <laughs> That's funny seeing him do that. Um, I, I, I did see Rara on that Alpha 3 cabinet. For, oh, for a lot of <laughs> like Alpha 3. Yeah, so you know, you pick up some <laughs> you pick up some tricks at every game you play. At least Benny Mara can't do it in the air, jump back and throw. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> that meter did kind of pay off. Meter building. Yeah. Does have the lead now. Oh, good break. Yeah, Chris G is really good at breaking the throws. But I think at the downside of that is that if you do know how to break those uh, nice little hesitation from R that it land that low B. If you do like know how to do, uh, break those OS tech throws, you can get blown up so badly. Like Bala, Bala versus Chris G at power up was a clear example. Like, I think Bala just did supers in his face all day. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's one thing about KOF, man. You gotta, you gotta have the balls, man. <laughs> like, you know, if you're a more conservative player, you know, you might not like doing things like that, but... It's KOF. Yeah, it's yeah, not, yeah, It's not, it's not Street Fighter. You gotta, you, like, you, you need to be able to, 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 to know when some shit just has to fly. It's true, like, you can slowly chip away people's health by you know, just using pokes. But, like, this game where, like, combo damage is that high, like, it's worth it just to try something risky. Whoa. Pretty risky. Ooh, gets that close uh, frame trap. If you time it right, you can actually combo it into each other. Crouch B and Stancy. Yeah. That's a pretty tight link, though. It's not as bad. Oh, here we go. Just because, if you keep in mind, like Iori, Iori has it too. I love it. Oh, I love it. But you gotta keep in mind, Kyo and Iori can do it. But like their close seats are two frames. That's yeah. a fat. It's like that's a four DP. Yeah. It's fast. All right. So Rai Rai on the verge of resetting this. Uh oh! How Chris much would you use? Without a fight. One. One. Oh, oh, oh God! No. Oh, oh wow! No, no run grab. There. Nice uppercut. Oh, yeah. It seems like the, the Benny Morrow players are—they don't have any faith in them you know, hitting hitting those TK. Uh, right Not today. Right I know Rai Rai. I can say that he's. Oh, he got the link. Yeah, there you go. You got the different link off there. One. One. Ooh. Okay. New combo. Yeah, I never seen that before. Roll back. Get off me. Overhead. Good block. Yeah. Will it be enough? <laughs> he blocked that with like a frame to go. He barely got that in there. Take it. EX right kick. Just do it. Oh. Oh. He doesn't even need oh. EX. Yeah. Regular right kick. Yeah. Fuck it. Yeah. All right. Rara takes that 3 0. 3 0 done. 3 0 done. 6 0 done, maybe? We'll see. Reset. Oh, okay. I see. I see. Shout out to uh, bring your girl to uh, fighting game tournaments. I will never understand that. But for those who do, shout out to you guys. Shout out to my girl, who's definitely not watching this shit. 
Anyway, we are officially reset here. Back to zero zero. Just looking at Chris G while he's playing, like just the way he's hitting buttons now, like he seems angry. Shaken. Yeah. Which is, I think, probably Chris G's biggest weakness. He, he seems to get flustered a lot when you he's know, playing games. He does seem to get flustered, but he does seem to be able to to kind of harness that uh, that aggression um, for a, after a <laughs> while. It, it, this thing, it, it seems like he breaks, but he breaks for a very short period of time. Then he gets better, and that is a crazy kind of kind of trait to have. I've noticed that about him. But nice luckily, grab. that only happens in kind of like winners finals or like grand finals, where you can have yeah, many, well, yeah, many, well, yeah, many matches. Definitely have time for it. Yeah. All right, seven seconds. Rai Rai's probably gonna sit back, build some meter from all the blocking. Oh. All right, Rai's gonna get a little bit of health back just because there's still like yeah, a, a little second. bit of time left. Yeah. yeah. Uh oh. Wow. Good damage from Rai Rai. Yeah. Not in the corner, so you don't get max damage. Whoa. -oh. Now we're in the corner. This should be nothing. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, it's still alive. Whoop! Wow, who used the who used the X? One of them used the X. I think Rai Rai used the X, and still uh, only got a trade. Yeah. Yeah, Crystal's sitting on full meter, so he didn't use it. Oh wow, tough speed to go into the stand, dude. Nice hesitation grab there from Rai Rai. Nice flow. That was that was that was nice. Down C, done early to intentionally whiff, but get him to stand and then go for the low B. Rari looking real comfortable right now. Oh. Oh, it goes for the front hit. Ooh, surprised he didn't get that upper cut off. Jump D from Benny Mar is so good. Jump D from Kyo, just as good. I wouldn't say just as good. It's good. It's good, but it's like, not just as good. down C is different uses. And that's a dead Benny Mario. One oh. Rai Rai. What is that? Uh, neither one. Any I mean, both of them now. <laughs> Rara wasn't losers. He reset it. So, yeah, Rara is up 1-0 now. Are really good for Minimar. Yeah. All his normals are just fantastic. Yeah. A little input error there from Rai Rai. Pays for it. Jumps in. Oh, gets that hit. Drive cancel. Level two. Makes it even. Oh, misses. Oh. Tries to read the jump. Whoa! Wow. How do you know? I don't know. Don't ask me that. I don't have the answers. 
Is that why we're not? Yeah, that's is yeah. that why we're not there? That's why I'm sitting here talking to you. Safe jump. Wow. <laughs> like that overhead. Same thing with Yori's overhead. I, I think Kyo's overhead's better, but like that overhead is so slow. It feels terrible when you get hit yeah, by it. Yeah, it does feel terrible. You're like, oh it. my god. Yuri takes like two steps before like putting his like <laughs> leg over his head and he brings it down on you. Yeah, shout out to Yuri with like what must be the elastic band between his legs. Because <laughs> he stretches that shit out. He finally gets rid of it. I yeah, guess, yeah, yeah. But. I guess like the flames clouded his judgment. <laughs> it's like, alright, why am I wearing this? Alright, gets another HD combo off. This will kill. Moido! Chris shaking his head. Ooh, he gets that tick. Very interesting how Rai Rai picks Kyo, EX Kill Mature with like the same tools. Yeah. Stan B into Rekos. I guess he really likes that, those hit confirms. Wow. I'm surprised I didn't hit Benny Maru. Oh. Wow. Right, oh. Back. Chris Still doesn't drops really his combo. Finish the combo there. And wow, Rari still jumps at him. I mean, he still has a character with like yeah. so much life. Low back. But it's funny because in similar situations before, Rara wasn't doing that. And now I guess you just feel so comfortable and so confident um, in how everything's going right now. He's just like, fuck it. I'm going to do what I want. And Rara, when he feels like he can do what he wants, really fucking hard to beat. Very scary. Oh, my God. He's pretty much like that in casuals all the time. He's impossible even casuals. So. Oh, gets another one of those. Thundering axe walk. <laughs> Terrible. I knew, I, I, knew, I knew he was going to do another one. I knew that. Because that's the thing about Rara. He's an asshole. And so, <laughs> if he has an opportunity to hit you in a way that will make him amused, he's going to go for that. And I know, like, hitting those overheads makes him feel good deep down inside. All right, let's see if Chris can recover from this. 2 0 Rara. Match point. Yeah, tournament point. What? Trying to go home with that sword. Uh oh, something's wrong with Rara stick. He can't move. Take the game. <laughs> <laughs> you press start. It's your only chance. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Killed the momentum. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but I guess I could restart it. Yeah, he might be like the number one character. He might be number one. Benny Maru? Yeah. Yeah, he's up I'd there. say he's he's up there. He's up there. The thing about this game, and like high tier characters, there's a lot of what. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Uh, well, we have more time to talk about this. Yeah. Who, Benny Maru? Benny Maru does. Hold on, hold on. No, which was good. Almost every character in this game is good. Like, like, no, 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 all right, so we're going back live here. Um, Rara up 2-0 in this final set. Best of three. This could be the last game. 
Chris G trying to stave it off. At least one more game. All right, gets the corner oh, pressure and misses. Drops it too far away from yeah, the corner. Yeah, not quite close enough. Ferrari closing that space. Now he's in there. Ferrari wanted to go for another grab there. Chris G said no. So I don't know if you noticed the, the way Rari plays. It's basically a lot of crouch beats, getting that tip, yeah. and just confirming off of off of it into you know. It's kind of similar to uh, Hyoshin's style of play, but I guess his pokes you know converts into damage. Well, yeah. Well, this is what I was saying. I, I, I was talking about this on uh, on Twitter with uh, Jaguar the other day because he was asking me like, how do I beat players like Hyoshin and like Steve H, who are like walls, and I'm like. If you know how to fight Rai Rai, you know how to fight these guys. It's the, to me, it's the exact same exactly. thing. Pretty Except much. for, like, Rai Rai establishes mid-range footsies, and then once he has that established, he encroaches on you. Whereas, like, Steve and Hoshin, like, they establish that, and then they wait for you to be stupid. Or move back. Yeah, well, that's the, like, like, they stay back and let you kill yourself. Rai Rai says, you know what, fuck you. I, 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 I know I've broken you down mentally enough for me to be able to do what the fuck I want to do. But it all starts from at mid-range. You can't stop them there. Or if you can't establish yourself there, there's nothing you can really do. Yeah. Like, if you notice earlier in the match, or the set, Rai Rai would do crouch B, crouch B, walk back, maybe, like, go back to, like, three quarters of the screen. Yeah. If you jump at him, he'll DP you. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Nope. Whoa, goes over him. Yes! All right, Krishit down to his last character, trying to avoid the OCV. You always hate getting OCV'd on the last game, too. But like, it can happen, like, midway in this set. Like, you're not going to remember that. But, like, yeah. the last game, I know he doesn't want that. So let's see what, 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 what Chris can do. Nice uppercut there. Oh. That's so oh. cheap. What, the empty jump? You know, just, yeah, the, the, that, right, like, the, the air, air right fireball. Yeah, that, that shit is cheap. Have you seen it done in the corner? Yeah, well, yeah, where yeah. you just do EX fireball? Like, you have to sit there and block the yeah. entire time. Now, that's cheap. Wow, nice grab from Rai Oh, Rai. close enough. Uh-oh. Rai Rai takes it. OCV, Benny Maru. Yeah, Rai Rai takes that in resounding fashion. Civil War 4 champ. Yeah, no, uh, no questions about that one right there. Yeah, but back to, um, we're talking about the characters and tiers. I think there's a ton of S-tier characters. And, yeah. and even for like the low tier, like I think there's a few low tier characters, but like when we say low tier, I'm thinking like A tier. There's a? S no. or A minus. There are that. I think I think there are definitely characters in this game that are pretty like, close to bad. Like pretty close to bad. I don't think there's any character that's like like a really bad character. There is none. But I I think definitely lower than like A A minus. Like at least B. If not lower, if not slightly lower, all like right. B minus C plus. Well, all right, here's my list for the weak characters. There's Terry, there's Athena, there's uh, Leona, uh, and uh, there's a few others. But the thing is, like, you've seen all those characters play. Oh, uh, my. Uh, and I guess a few, I forgot there's a couple others. But, like, those characters, if you've seen them play, like, they're really hard to fight. Yeah, yeah. I agree. But like, I agree. What translates? I just don't think they're a character. I don't think, I don't think they're a tier character. Okay. What think. translates into being like really good in this game is, I guess, like just getting damage. Damage is pretty much where it comes down. Or BS. To me, to me, it's it's more than damage though. It's it's damage and I mean, I'm just in the game though. It's damage and you know your character's propensity for being able to create that damage. And all right, all right yeah, we're gonna run some promos real quick. There you so. go. I'm gonna hand off the mic to Spooky. Buy stuff. Oh, okay. Buy stuff. Buy this. Whatever's about to come on screen, buy it. Buy this. Oh, that's not a promo. But uh, check out if you guys aren't following any of these uh, links. Twitter, Team Spooky, Facebook, I Play Winner. Uh, got that donation link. Oh, okay. I was just running a video. Okay.
it back. Shout out to Seth Mussy for creating those, uh, well, the one for season beatings, the, the visuals. I think he's also doing uh, Evo as yeah, well. He's doing Evo also. He did it last year, and I think did it two years ago. I think last year. I don't think he did it two years ago, though. Yeah. Very nice graphics. Naruto. What? You saw that tournament for Naruto? No, I didn't see it. Oh, man. I wasn't. I was telling everyone else to watch the promos, but oh. I didn't. <laughs> man, they had they had that as a tournament game. Really? Well, shout out, shout out to, uh, shout out to that. <laughs> I, don't, not, I don't know. Maybe it's like a godlike tournament game. Who knows? Robin's out here giving out swords to uh, tournament champions. That can't be legal. Yeah, the thing is, like, people traveled here, like, yeah, bus, like, yeah, airplane. Like, like, how are you gonna get that home? Yeah, like Wolf Crone, right? Like. Let's say he went Street Fighter 4. I'm sure he flew here. Sword on the flight. <laughs> like, uh, it's already hard enough getting your stick through 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 airport security. Oh my God. Rari Rari has just been knighted. Oh. Yeah. Should have been mine. Should have been mine too. What? Well, I am looking forward to. Um, Keats' this tournament. UFGT? Yeah, you're going he, out there? Uh, I'm going to try to. But uh, I don't know if you've seen the prizes he's giving out. Yeah, so yeah, the Infinity, Infinity Gauntlet. Infinity Gauntlets. Yeah. yeah. Those that's, look really nice. That's definitely a, a, a nice little touch there. No question. Shout out to uh, UFGT. Yo, Shadowloo Showdown. That's, that's gonna coming be up. That's going to be weekend. great. Yeah. That's going to be godlike. That is going to be godlike. So many players. Yeah, I want to see the Chinese KOF guys. I hope they stream KOF. I don't, see, that's the thing. I don't know how big the scene is in uh, they have to Australia. Stream. They have, if, they're, if they're flying people out, they have to at least stream some of it. I th and they're, they're going to have two um, two streams coming out of Shadowloo, I'm pretty sure. Well, that's good. So it, sh it should all get streamed, all the, all the good stuff. Street Fighter Four is going to be crazy. Of course. Like, I've lost interest in Street Fighter 4 by and large, but like I'm still gonna watch that. That's gonna be pretty crazy. Yeah, just like International Street Fighter 4, like still, yeah, it's still yeah. really exciting. International Street Fighter 4 is still really good. I agree. It kind of died down in the U.S. Well, maybe I think we're oversaturated to it because we always see, you know, Wolf Crow, Justin. See, I, the thing is, I'm not even sure if, it, if it's died down on the whole. I think people still are gonna play it. It's just that. You know, we've been playing Street Fighter 4 now for three or four years, and then just all of a sudden, a bunch of games just came out. And so, you know, I stopped playing Street Fighter 4 when KOF came out, but, you know, that's not to say I'm never going to play it again. You know, I don't really know. I'm just, I'm focused on KOF right now. It's like I'm sure some people are focusing on Skullgirls, some people are focusing on Soul Calibur, and, you know, people were focusing on uh, Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Right. Um, it looks like that's dying out, so, I mean, 4 has to, has to come back out. If uh, if Cross Tekken is gonna is, is gonna you know be this weak this quickly, uh, but you know who knows you know it, there's no telling what, you know, what's gonna happen. But I wouldn't count Street Fighter Four out just yet. Evo should be really good as well. Yeah, I mean Evo's gonna be great. Yeah, there's no question. About I keep forgetting that. that's almost around the corner. Yeah, it's early this year, so yeah, it's, it's two months. I gotta book my flight. <laughs> yeah, I haven't done that yet. Shout out to Evo, obviously. But uh, are we putting uh, Cross Tekken on? Yeah, right. Cross Tekken is next. I'm going to get out of here, actually. Yeah. I, I just want to play KOF. I want to play KOF, too, but I also want to leave. Oh, you're going to go home now? Yeah, I think we're just going to dip. Nah. I just want to play more casuals. I kind of want to do that, too. But if there's, if there's, I don't think we even have a setup. Uh, Jack has a setup over there. Oh, Jack's setup? Yeah. No. Oh, shit. I'll play that then. Because that's the other thing, man, all the casual setups here, like, they haven't had DLC characters. I'm like, I can't even play my team. I'm out there playing, like, fucking Kenso and shit. All right. So I'm, I'm actually much better with Kenso than I thought I was, though. Shout out to me. Oh, really? Sweep yeah. is good. <laughs> but I'm looking at the cross second, uh bracket right now. Winner's bracket, we got uh, Magman versus Dominion and Ooh. Lud versus Chris G. Ooh. Oh, Lud made it in the winners? Yeah. It's Jibbo versus Wolf Crone and Death Note? Killinator. Uh, I don't know those I know players. Jibbo's been going in on cross tech and trying to get people to play it and try to get people to not think it sucks. So, hopefully he can blow some shit up. I always like seeing Jibbo win. Yeah. It's Especially, always, like, after creative stuff. I always like watch, watching him play. Just, yeah, he's very creative. Yeah. But, like, during that time, I guess he, like, he had work. 
you know, real life kicked in. He disappeared. Yeah. He had one of the best guns in the U.S. Yeah, he definitely did. And I know he joined. Uh, he joined the Air Force. Yeah. And so you know, can't get too much playing time in, especially not as soon as you join the Air Force. You know, I'm sure there's other more pressing shit to do. But um, I know he's back playing now, and so I kind of do want to see what he has, what he has in store, but. I don't know if enough for me to want to stay. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> but if you're watching the stream, you should definitely stay because you're already at home. So stay at home and watch the stream. Um, but, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely getting off the mic because I don't know this game well enough to actually commentate. So um, once again, thanks, for everyone, for watching. Keep watching. Play KOF. It's a great game. Just have on the mic. Holler at me on Twitter. What is your Twitter? Oh, yeah, word. Yeah. Um, nah, have any H underscore H A V. If you think I suck, tell me. <laughs> if you think I don't suck, well, keep that to yourself. I don't like Twitter love. I like Twitter hate. So send me that hate. Oh, speaking of a shout out, Team Hate. Um, shout out Xanadu, Baltimore, Maryland. If you're a Maryland player and I don't know you, that's a problem. Uh, there's something wrong, very yeah, wrong. Come out to Xanadu Games, Baltimore, Maryland. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say, I guess. All right. So that's that. Keep watching. Team Spooky, Civil War 4, out. All right. Thank you, Hav. Um, I don't know if I'm going to stay on or not. Uh, who? But, uh, but uh, I don't cross second. I don't know. I still think it's too early to judge it. There's some cool things about it, but uh, commentary. I don't know. It's over there. So what's banned today? Oni. Oni's always banned. Always banned. Always banned. Always got like always banned. But uh, over there, I'm watching to the corner over there. You guys probably can see it. I'm Beefy Techie. His name. He's still streaming us at four. A lot of people are crowding over there while uh, we're getting cross tech and set up. I'm gonna commentate that match. Oh man, Bison versus Cami. Is that K Brad? Oh, K. Is that K Brad? I can't tell. Marlon Pie. Jacob? Huh? Jacob? Yeah, Big white guy? Yeah, white guy. Oh wow. Okay. Good shit. Match point. Gets hit by that psycho. Ooh, good combo. Oh, is that a punish? Got him. Yeah, psycho. Oh, no. Is it over? Oh, it's 1-1. One, one. If you guys are trying to watch the stream, should yeah, people are linking in the stream chat. Just click on that. I'm going to be commentating that until we get more people over here. Uh, ooh. Martin Pye gets out of the corner. No punish for the teleport. DP, DP. Jacob is getting that, uh, oh no, frame trapped. Catching pressing buttons, oh, Cammy's going nuts. Oh, made it safe. Roundhouse. Oh, it was spooky, I'm just commentating that match over there. <laughs> All right, what's up, guys? This is Spooky. We're about to get it popping with that cross taking momentarily. So just sit tight. Meantime, thank you, as always, for tuning in. And I want to remind you guys that if you want to be immediately notified whenever Team Spooky is streaming, you can follow us here on Own3D. It'll email you when we're live. Pretty cool. 
Oh no! <laughs> like you need like 20 of these when you're watching Marvel 3. Oh, for them to be loud enough? Yeah. Nah, I'm good. No, no. Man. I'm good. Thank you. You just need to like, got to like chuck them in the air or something. Yeah, Psycho Chronic just came over with an energy drink. He was like, yo, I have this. <laughs> huh? Oh, it's a half and a half. Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> uh huh? No, I did not. There's a girl at a desk, and she got your money, and you got signed too. Okay. All right. What is wrong with this projector, man? I don't know, man. Is it like, are they bumping into it? Is that why it keeps doing that? So confused. Well, yeah. I gotta get my money back. But, oh, Jibbo wearing hat. All right. So it looks like we're gonna have Jibbo versus MCZ. Marn dot Wolf Crone in the house. Yeah, this is kind of scary. <laughs> Good camera cut from Spooky. Oh yeah, my bad. We I, no, no, I no, 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 don't worry about it. <laughs> Wolf Crone setting up his headset right now. Um, shout up. Uh, huh. Yo, Wolf Crone, can I see that for a second? Can I take a look at this? Okay. I only use so I got that one. Okay, this is. Do you need to power this with a USB? Yeah, Okay, okay. Um, so what Wolf Crone has here is a tri. Oh, this is a Trident headset? Yeah, Okay. I don't know what it's called. Telling this to Banana Ken because he's trying to find a way to use a headset as well. Wolf Cohen here has... Oh, let me hold it up to the camera. Well, is a Triton headset or something connecting to the back of the Xbox. Uh, and then he has, like, you know, the RCA cables plugged into his headset. And I think he has to power his headset using the USB cable in the back. USB port. But I guess we're right, now, right now, the USB... Um, the stream setup is, I guess, conflicting with his thing. So Spooky's just hooking up to the splitter and should be good. But tournament players, look into this because, oh my god, it is hard to hear uh, the sound, especially on like the Asus monitors. You're not going to get any sound. But luckily, this tournament was not that bad. Uh, Renegade provided the setups, the VGA uh, monitors are with... Uh, just speakers on the side, and those are much, much better than the Asus monitors. But yeah, look into that. It's always good to hear your match when you're playing. Oh, I need one of those. I definitely need one of those. Got it. It's very important to get the sound to work. All right. So seems like Wolf Crone did get his headset to work. He's still gonna stab me later, but it's all right. <laughs> He's just waiting for the right moment <laughs> to get at me. Sorry, Crone. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. All right. Let's get some game audio in here. All right. So again, we're gonna have um, Wolf Crone. I haven't seen Wolf Chrome play in a while. Is he still playing Jin? Uh, I'm not sure, man. Oh. I've only I've only seen him play against Arturo online, and that was all Jin. Oh, okay. So I haven't seen much else. Wolf Chrome is definitely an online monster. <laughs> 